Good morning, everybody. It's December 6th, late morning. It's about 33 degrees outside. As you can see, we've had snow and I shoveled off snow off the uh, first two compost bins and I took these covers off, which are just recycled cardboard. Here we have some insulating foam panels that I put on to try to keep a little heat inside the bed and uh, maybe make the season last a little longer. Unfortunately, this one broke. I'll have to repair it. But let's see what's going on in there. Now, what you see on top there is leaves, autumn leaves that I piled up and ran a lawnmower over so that they have less airspace inside them. And uh, it's a lasagna method. So there are layers of material. There are, there are uh, shredded leaves, there's um, semi-finished compost that I transferred, and this is fairly heavy stuff. What I did have in this bed was, this is where I was putting a lot of food scraps, but I pulled the food scraps out and transferred them. You'll see them next in the next bin. But this is pretty much what I expected to find. It's, uh, as I say, it's 33 degrees outside. This is probably 40 or 50 or so. It's not warm, but it's still got biological activity and I don't see any worms. There were, oh, there were some worms in here. And I hope I transferred a lot of them to do more work in the next bin. Oh, there's one. Where'd you go? Yes, there are baby worms around here. There's one right there. Live and healthy. Okay. Let's put this one to bed and move over to the next one. Now, I transferred a lot of the food um, material in here so that it could be more active. And there were a lot of baby worms getting started as of a couple of weeks ago in this bed. So, um, let's see what we can find. I use this cardboard year round to keep the sun off of the compost so I don't ever want it uh, exposed to sun and, and uh, elements just because it stays more stable that way. I see worms already. There were a lot of, uh, there was a lot of uh, worm breeding going on. So this is pretty good. They're right on, I didn't think I'd be seeing them right on top of the pile, but here they are on December 6th doing just fine. Inside, I put um, garden scraps, stuff which I can show you over here. This is the material. I, at the end of the season, I collected a lot of leaves, branches, and uh, vines from cleaning up the garden. And I put that in layers in this to give it a, some airspace and a uh, place for the for exchange to take place. Now, this is pretty tangled because of all the vines, but I'm interested in what's in there for activity. There's some pomegranate rind and some, some uh, lots of leaves, lots of worms, eggshells. So this is still an active compost bed and um, that's just what I was hoping to find. So now we'll go over to the garden for chapter three.